has to come here in the library. So first of all, you have to open lab view. In lab view, this is my front panel, and here is my block diagram window. In this window, I have first control and simulation toolbox. In this toolbox, I go to control design toolbox and lock it here. So for draw a transfer function, I go to model construction. In this model construction, I have to select construct transfer function model and I drag it here. Then I select transfer function equation. After all, transfer function equation. Now I connect these two functions or two nodes. And here I have a control, create control for my numerator and create control for my denominator. Now I create a indicator over here and this is my program for draw a transfer function. Now I go to my front panel window here is my front panel and in this I select a transfer function like 1 upon s square plus s plus 1 and when I run I got a transfer function 1 upon s square plus s plus 1 this is my transfer function in left view the left side denotes my constant term like I put 2 over here and run again this and right most side is my order of the system in terms of s like I have to put a 0 in the system I put 1 then my transformation become s plus 1 upon s square plus s plus 2 this is my transformation okay now 